So one thing about our LEGO channel is we love talking LEGO deals. And although Black Friday and Cyber Monday are a little bit a ways away, we still have some pretty interesting deals that we should probably discuss in today's video. So if you're interested in that, stick around. Uh, we potentially will have an insider's, of, not an insider's weekend, but an entire week of double vip or double insiders i don't know what to call it you guys let me know in the comments below is it going to be like insiders double points and double insiders points or are they going to continue the name of vip which i highly doubt right since they changed the entire name of the entire program but anyways i did find this page from uh, 2023 it says uh insiders weekend is coming 11 18 11 19 is this a projected weekend for double insiders and already showing us some black friday sales Ooh, we'll discuss that later because uh that's still over a month and a half away away a ways away uh but let's actually talk about what's coming in october uh and should cook kick off in october 10th and 11th uh one big thing of course is amazon prime day deals um they are going to be doing prime day on october 10th and 11th and that's probably why you see lego you know probably reaching out and thinking hey we're going to do a you know double vip or double insiders or whatever you want to call it uh at the same time as well so unfortunately amazon um they gave me some insights as a creator they gave me some insights to what's it's going to be available however there was legitimately three lego sets that were on their you know inside access or whatever it was i'm not gonna even bring them up because the deals were not even worth it instead um i'm just gonna hope that that was just a flaw and they're just not prepared to showcase us that information and are rather gonna have you know really good sales when the time comes but anyways I, I'm, I have faith, right? Like, I know it's been a tough year, especially for businesses, so I'm expecting to see some really good sales. I think it's going to be a great shopping time. Uh, if you early Christmas shoppers, this might be a great time for you to get some presents locked in and loaded. Uh, I, I truthfully believe it's going to be a great time to buy. Although I am, of course, extremely excited for Black Friday. I think this is like a little pre-Black Friday sale. So really exciting stuff. Again, those dates are October 10th and 11th uh, that we should note for Amazon. Um, they do have quite a few sales, you know, already existing, right? Like, uh, they have this one up, you know, for the Minecraft, 120% off. Like, your 20 to 25% off is, like, kind of standard. Um, they have a variety of sets, you know, in that range. A lot of them are kind of older. Uh, one that I did find that was pretty good was the AT-AT -AT Walker for 14% off. This set's going to be retiring here at the end of 2023. So, again, you know, if you're a LEGO fan and you're collecting LEGO, you're probably focusing more on that ginormous list of sets that are potentially retiring at the end of 2023 um so you know sets like that are going to make it high up on the list and unfortunately i type in lego and like a bunch of non-lego products show up like what is all this stuff so anyways that's that on that um aspect one other thing for you lego room enthusiasts um last prime day they had i think was maybe q1 of this year or no maybe it was like june or july whatever it was it, it was it feels like a long time ago but it probably really wasn't um they ran sales on these acro mills, and the reason I'm bringing this up is because I personally use these, and I actually picked up a couple more during that sale. Uh, they tend to not really go on sale too much, but uh, I'll definitely be keeping an eyes open for these. I know these are really good for you mock builders and storing parts for Lego rooms. I, I really like them uh, after having them and owning them. I don't think I'd go to anything else except these, so if there's a sale on that, I'll definitely try to keep the channels updated, but um, this is another good one that we'll potentially see uh, on a nice little sale. Uh, now, one other thing we are kind of, uh, well, we kind of don't have anymore is um, the promotional items for uh, October, right? There's been a handful. Uh, there's a couple good forums that are showcasing everyone. To this one we're using is Falcon Bricks. Uh, but anyways, the UCS Venator gift with purchase, that sold out in, uh, I wouldn't say around 12 hours or so, like 12, 14 hours. Pretty crazy stuff there. With that being said, that's not the only promo in 2023. Um, this just happens to be the only one of the only Star Wars ones, which, of course, makes the price go up and all that kind of stuff. But anyways, uh, there's still a couple good promos, like the maze is still going on, and then the pirate um, add-on. Actually, I don't think they have the pirate one. I think that was for, like, a treasure hunt type thing. Uh, but they have the Halloween VIP add-on pack. Uh, and then, of course, double VIP points are coming. Um, actually, there's a couple good calendars that I think BrickClicker put together. October 10th, it looks like we're getting the Pirate Cove gift with purchase whatever that one may be the mystic witch and also the double vip points uh if you could check that more out on brick clickers page it does a really good job of you know showcasing what gift with purchases but again that's not the main focus of today's video the main focus is of course sales uh like the lego group right uh, they have a sales page entirely on the lego website right and they're, they're spending about the same sets for quite some time right like the table football 30 percent off a black panther bus 40 percent off and like you could 
clearly people are still not buying these, right? Um, from my understanding, there's going to be an addition to this list in the October 10th to you know 15th double VIP or double insider of week, whatever it may you want to call it. With that being said, they're supposed to add more sets. Uh, that's kind of the idea there, and then maybe even increase sales on some of the sets in here. So it looks like they're really trying to move some of these sets off the shelf. Might be if you have your eyes on any of these sets, it's probably going to be a good time to go ahead and grab and snag some of these. Um, yeah, just keep that in mind. Uh, definitely do your due diligence here. These, this is probably a good opportunity to pick up some of these, uh, pick up some of these sets at a discounted rate. I know there's not a huge list here, but uh, who knows? Maybe they'll add some of the last chance to buy. Like I said, Lego collectors here. Probably really focusing, dialing in on this list right here because these are Lego gave us an entire list of sets that are retiring here at the end of 2023. And um, yeah, that would be pretty nice to see some of these. Uh, unfortunately, I just don't think like sets like the police station are going to like go on sale uh, from the Lego group. Like I, I just, I truthfully just don't think that that'll ever happen. Who knows, right? We see some crazy things. Uh, it would be pretty awesome though to get this one, you know, 20% off. I would definitely eat that up. Um, now again, you know, Rockton offers like 10 to 20% off sometimes during these weeks as well. So make sure to take advantage of your cashback programs because you might get this 10% off uh, even just with a program like that. So another good one is the Santa's visit. I know we talked about that heavily on the live stream, but 100 bucks there, time at the end of the year. I've been contemplating this one, and it's probably time I pick it up. Um, yeah, before uh, 2023 year end comes fast, right? Um, but anyways. There's a couple other promos uh, that are, you know, highly anticipated, right? Houses of the World 4 is supposed to be available at the end of 2020, or October of 23, so it starts like the 23rd. Uh, we definitely saw images of that one already, right? The architectural um, Lego gave us images of that. Uh, again, that's, you know, potentially just going to be, you know, here at the end of October is kind of the anticipated. So, again, those calendars are fan base made, right, and um, potentially are going to be made and whatnot, so... Keep that in mind. Um, but take advantage of the Amazon sales. Uh, another good program is going to be the Target. Target has the Circle. Uh, Target Circle, I believe, is their program called. Uh, let me see if we could find that one. So we could type in Target Circle. Rewards program. Yeah. Whoop. Well, anyways. They have... Um, they have a Target Circle program, and they offer quite a few different deals. Um, it looks like October 7th as well. They're going to be now through October 7th. So they're, I'm sure they'll be competing with Amazon, and they'll be competing with Walmart, another one, right? Take advantage of your guys' Walmarts. They will be throwing up sales left and right. I believe Walmart already has the Hoth double pack. So Hoth, Lego, two-in-one pack. I believe they already have this one. Let's let's check. Oh boy, yeah, forty-five bucks. You can pick this one up. Um, yeah, so you can pick that one up as well. Pretty good looking set. Um, and yeah, that's kind of it for the prep, guys. I'm really excited for more Amazon um, Lego sales, Target Lego sales, Walmart Lego sales, and of course Lego Lego sales. So. Pretty exciting stuff. If you want to see more sales videos, guys, I will definitely, uh, this is more of just a preparation, and uh, I'll definitely keep the channel updated. So if you don't want to miss those, make sure to hit that subscribe button, turn on notification bells, and uh, we'll keep the channels updated. Anyways, guys, that's going to wrap it up. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Love you guys. Hope you have an amazing rest of the day. I'm Crystal from Stud City. We'll see you in the next one. Peace out.